Hi guys, welcome back to the channel. It's another old scripting tutorial. Today I'm going to show you how to script a fading block in Roblox Studio. So like, so like, here's an example. So like, um, for people who don't know what a fading block is, let's say you're like, Let's say you're doing an obby. And then and then you're so close and you're so close to beating the obby, you just you just have to touch this part. You just have to touch this part. But when you when once you jump, the part fades away. So you go Yeah. So it's just like, like it disappears, and then it's like there's nothing there. So let's just create that first. Let's make our part. Let's make our fading part. And if you want, you can change to fade. Also, if you if you if you just wanna if you wanna if you wanna if you wanna. If you wanna Go into this game and see all all this stuff I did. Uh, it'll be linked in the description below. Fade, fading apart. Uh, why not make it a uh, neon black? So we got that. So we'll just put that there, and then inside it add a script. And let's rename it to fade. We, we don't ha you don't, I just like renaming it. You don't have to. Alright, now let's put this in a while true do loop. Okay, so, so the script keeps looping and looping. It'll keep looping. So do script dot parent dot Trans transparency equals is so right now it's zero. So then we need to add a weight sign. Um, let's do um. I don't want to do one second because it because. I think it would be fading for like a long time. So let's do um 0.1. And then we can just copy this. And we do 0.1. And then 0.2. Uh here let me just get an extra part right here. Let's take away the script. So this is 0.1. Still a little visible. 0.2. 9. 8. 9. Okay, 9. After 9, it's going to be, be 1. So. 2.3 0 0.4 0 0.5 0 0.6 0 0.7 0 0.8 0 0.9 and this instead of doing zero zero point ten like like that we have to do just one just one and then we have another one script script dot parent dot can instead of it's can collide 
if you guys don't know what can collide is, uh, let me show you. Let me show you. So oh, let's just make a big wall. And then, then we're in our game with our <laughs> rainbow part. And then, so you can't walk through, we, you can't walk through this part. But, but, if you can collide it, and if we hit play again, then, it just, well, it just fell down because this was anchor. This was can collide true, but the part we added was can collide. It, it's can collide was set to false, so you can just go right through the part. I should anchor it next time, but yeah. All right, let's just anchor this. So can collide equals false. And then we have our end. So let's try to spawn location. Why not? Um, trying to try to Oh, oh no, yeah. My, my recording thing is, is uh, covering the way. So just get rid of the decal, or tr set the transfer of the decal to one, but just, you don't have, I'm just gonna, this is my spawn location. This is my spawn location. So we, we can just hit play. Then you see we have our rainbow, we have our rainbow thing. And up oh, there's my part. Whoa. In my opinion, it's a little too fast. So Let's do 0.4. I believe 0.4 is fine. Okay. And 0.1 because because we want it, because we want you to die. We want, sorry. If you guys don't know what I mean, I'm sorry. I don't mean that. So look, it's fading. And I can just, I can just fall. But, do you see that? It, it's fading right now. But the only problem is it's, it's still, it's stuck in can collide. It's stuck in can collide. So, what we need to do is to copy all that and paste it. And then we go to 0.9. We do 0.8. They do 0.7. We do 0.6. Then we do. Uh, let's just hold on. Let's just add a weight here. Uh, how long? Let's make it four. Why not? All right. So. So wait, zero point one. So and then we just name this to true, and this will go in a big loop. Yeah. 
so yeah let's do way two there then we can test it out right now because yeah and oh no yeah so that's how it works that's how it works so if you guys like this video give it a big thumbs up see you guys later bye